Okay, so after first installing your programmable switch, uh, this is how you set it up. So this button, the sorry, the big button, is the button you press for about three seconds to access your menu. So that is your mode. So the first option is automatic. So your switch operates automatically and uh, it turns out the light, it turns on the light depending on how you set it up or your desired settings. If you want to change that to manual mode, you press the top right button. If you want to change it to a random or erratic mode, press the right button a second time. But I want it to be on um I want it to be on automatic. I want it to be on automatic. So I'm gonna put it on automatic and press the big button. It blinks a few times, meaning it's selected. So I wanna set a time. I go to time, I press the big button, and it blinks. I want it to be um, 12 uh, time. I don't want it to be on the 24 hour time, the military time. So that is already blinking. If you want to change it, you press the left button, you press enter. So your big button serves as an enter. A button as is on a keyboard. But I want it to be on the usual 12 o'clock time. So I select that, I press the enter button or the big button, and it asks me to set a time. The time is already set. If not, you use this to adjust it. And you press enter, you select the next one. You use the left two buttons, small buttons to adjust it. You press enter, I've already set it up. It pops up your year. Year is 2018. Or you can use this button to change it. Uh, that is changed. And that is the month. It's March. It's already set. Or you change it using the left two buttons. Press enter. The day today is the ninth. Same way already set up so time is is done i go to configuration and configuration low i usually want to let, let my screen on uh, with some light on so i left i leave it on low if you do not want it on low you want it on high you press the button it changes to high i if you don't want it off you turn it off third time turn it off i prefer it on low i mean low so i'm gonna leave it on low and press enter and uh, daylight saving, I prefer it to be on daylight saving so that it checks automatically. So I'll leave it on enter. If you do not prefer that, turn it off. If I prefer, so I'll leave it on and press enter. And uh, the latitude, uh, depending on where you live, there's a table in the uh, manual which lists all the latitude. Here it is. So you have all the latitude that's for Canada, US. So just find your latitude and input that. On latitude if you do not want to change it then leave it as default it's good for most US uh, countries I mean uh, US states so I prefer that's mine so I'm gonna enter it uh, my longitude enter it and this is adjustment you might want to leave this on zero depending on where you live in the United States leave it on zero and the configuration is now the program is a bit tricky uh, in order to program make sure you set the time correctly if you do not set the time correctly your programming order will not work so press enter i pref so this is program one you have numerous programs so program one is on so basically what this is saying is at six this is default setting at 6 3 p.m my light outside is gonna my light outside is gonna turn on and um, when i go to nest at 6 27 a.m in the morning uh, when the sun is rising my light is gonna turn off so that's a default setting but if you do not prefer that you want to change the times to suit you so you can press the enter again 
So those are the days in, in, in the week. Uh, you can press the left or right to change which days you want to operate. None. If you want Monday, if you want only Monday, I prefer all days because I hate waking up on weekends, on the weekdays, turning off and turning on the light. So I'll prefer all of them. I press enter. Now the time you desire to have your lights on, uh, you set it on. Make sure the time you want your lights off should be on. Uh, you see the, the, the sun symbol on the top right corner. Uh, I prefer it to be on, on the default. So if you want to change it, you use, if you want to change it, you go there and you, you change that to what you desire. I prefer to be off at 603, I mean, to be off at 627 in the morning. So I'll press enter. And I press enter. Comes back the program. I want it to be on at 6.03 p.m. So same way, if you decide to change it, you change it to suit your um, your desire. I want that to be on there. So I'm done with my setting. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to long press the big button and it takes me to the screen. So if you don't want to wait, for the controls to take over automatic, you can manually turn on your light by pressing the big switch. So if I press the switch, this blue light is gonna light on. The minute that my light outside is on. So let's take a look. As you can see, my light is on. If I want to manually turn it off, and press that button again, then the blue light is gone, in the indicator light is gone. My light bulb is off. So that's how you manually turn on and off uh, using the switch. So that's the basic setting. And um, if there is something else um, that you do not follow in the video, just uh, leave a test you know b below the video and i will respond uh, as soon as possible so if you enjoy this simple step-by-step -step, uh, task of setting installing and setting up uh, your honeywell smart programmable switch give it a thumbs up and um, subscribe and give it a like and if you, there's something else you want me to do uh, just leave a comment. Thank you for watching. See you again.